guys, welcome. Uh, today I want to show you my 10 favorite of all times beginner cybersecurity book. You that start in cybersecurity should take a look at those books because they are great learning, they share knowledge with you, and it's a great place for you to start your cybersecurity journey. With that being said, let's get started. My number one book right here is Kali Linux Review. This book was written by the offensive security guys, the guys who developed and maintain Kali Linux. And this gives you an in-depth understanding of the operating system, how to install it, how to, how to partition a hard drive. This book will teach you in-depth everything about the operating system from download, installation, all the way up to ready. So Kali Linux Reveal, I highly encourage you guys to take a look. My second book is actually my all-time favorite book, written by the legend Occupy the Web, Linux Basics for Hackers. This book will teach you Linux commands. It'll really make you feel like an advanced hacker. There's so much great content in this book so many great commands basic commands it'll teach you everything about the directories in the operating system and this book actually should be a required reading in major universities i don't know i think most of us don't really go to college but i highly encourage this should be a requirement all around you know cybersecurity platforms that teach cybersecurity this book is a must. It is and it will always be my favorite of all times because this book taught me so much. Not only about the commands, but the main thing that you need to take from things is to think as a hacker. You know, this book will show you the way, but you need to walk the path. So Linux Basics for Hackers from Master Occupy the Web. This is a must. Book number three, also by Master Occupy the Web, Network Basics for Hackers. You know, this book will teach you all the networking protocols, what do they do, what do they entail. This book shares knowledge. You know, this book is a gift to all the beginners that want to get into cybersecurity and learn everything about networking and the networking protocols this book also should be a requirement in all the cybersecurity platforms even though they teach you but master occupy the web makes it so easy for you to understand when you read this book this is actually a very easy reading very straightforward it's a must get it book number four obviously like i said before programming you don't have to be you don't have to be a full-on software developer but you do need to understand the basics of programming and where else to start other than Python. Python Crash Course. You do need to know Python because so many exploits are written in Python. So many tools are written in Python and sometimes you are gonna have to customize those tools, customize those exploits or even write your own. And for that, you're gonna have to know Python, at least the security aspect of it. But to know the security aspect of it, you need to know the basics and everything starts with the basics. So Python Crash Course. Book number five. Book number five is Black Hat Python. Continuing with your programming education, Black Hat Python will teach you Python, will teach you the Python techniques that you need to know, basic techniques, but for security. You know, when you're out there in an assessment and you don't have access to the tools, you're, you're, you're not connected to the internet, you're only on the internet, and you're gonna have to know how to write a TCP listener, a TCP client or UDP listener, and for that, this book will teach you it's great. There's so much great content here that will sharp your Python skills. And I highly recommend so you can, you know, after you learn this book, you're going to be on the next level of program. You're going to be a little more in depth and already not afraid of learning programming. You know, because for me, programming is very scary. And, you know, I avoided, to be honest, in the beginning until I had to 
you know, get past the fear, learn programming and see that it's not, not that bad. So Black Hat Python. Book number six, Google Hacking for Penetration Testers. I always liked open source intelligence and if you're a beginner, it's good for you to know this, that Google is actually one of the greatest hacking tools out there. And open source intelligence, you know, information gathering is where you're gonna spend most of your time, you know, collecting information about the target or doing open source intelligence for a client or something on a company or even the company that you're hired, you're hired to penetration tests. So highly recommend Google Hacking for Penetration Testers is a great book with so much great content in here. Book number seven, Nmap 6 Cookbook. You know, Nmap, what can we do without Nmap? You know, when we start an assessment, we need to know, we need information about the target. And this book helped me so much with so much great content. If you're a beginner, you're gonna wanna have this book because it's gonna show you the basic techniques like regular TCP scanning, UDP scanning, host discovery, port discovery, how to evade and bypass firewalls. You know, this book is so good for you to starting out as a penetration tester. And Math Cookbook 6. Book number eight, Serious Cryptography. Can't talk about cybersecurity, information security without talking about cryptography. You know, cryptography, encryption, obviously, we need to know the basics of it, what a hash algorithm is, what are the different types of encryption algorithms that are out there, uh, symmetric encryption, asymmetric encryption, private key, public key, you know, all the good stuff. This book, you have to have it on your shelf so you can always consult the book. It's a must. It's also a must for beginners and even for advanced people because obviously we forget stuff, we have to constantly Google stuff. So, serious cryptography. Book number nine, PGP and GPG. Talking about encryption, obviously, uh, cybersecurity, information security. We need to know, we need to know about private key, public key. We need to know how to encrypt files, how to decrypt files with a GUI and with the command line. And this book is thin, objective, amazing. This book will level up your skill set when you're out there typing commands on the terminal to decrypt files, being able to read files. And that's how we send files to each other. We encrypt the file and we decrypt them once the file is received. PGP and GPG. Book number 10, a book that helped me so much when I was starting off my career as a penetration tester when, or when I was just a script kitty, a hacker wannabe, The Hacker's Playbook 2, second edition. So much great content in this book, great technique, great learning. You know, there's so much you can learn from this book and the tools in it. And this is just amazing. This is another book by Peter Kim. Uh, he wrote some of the tools that are here in this book. And I, I don't know if he wrote all of them actually, but probably not. But he is a great cybersecurity uh, professional. I don't know much about him, but I know he's popular. I know he's done a lot for the community. This book is just amazing. You know, it helped me a lot. If you're a beginner, I highly encourage you to have I'm sure there's, you know, I remember a couple years ago, they already had the Hackers Playbook number three. Maybe they even have the four out there. I don't really know, but I just want to let you guys know that this was a great, uh, this was a great help for me in the beginning. It actually made me look like I knew what I was doing. So the Hackers Playbook number two. And that's it, those are my 10 favorite books. Obviously the most important ones are Linux Basics for Hackers and Network Basics for Hackers, both by the legend master Occupy the Web. I highly encourage you to buy those books or buy the course on his website, uh, hackersarise.com. Like I said, when you're starting in something, you need to start with the basics. You don't build the house from the roof. You need to you build the house from the ground up. And you have to do the same thing with your skill set. You know, pay your dues, 
and you go far. So, you know, discipline, with a lot of discipline comes a lot of freedom. And if you like this video, please like and subscribe, help the channel grow. The more you guys help me, the more I'm going to be able to continue to bring good content for you. If you guys have recommendations, please feel free to, uh, to leave a comment below. And that is it for now. So I want to and I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for you guys watching this video. And hopefully I'll see you again. Thank you very much.